What's up you guys, welcome to the video. Got a quick one for you guys today. So what do you do when your BMW is leaking coolant? Let's hop right in. So what do you do when your BMW is leaking blue stuff? Can't really see it anymore, it also rained today. Getting a little dark, but we got some work to do. So obviously I gotta take you guys along for the ride. But what do we do when we're leaking blue stuff from the driver's side of the car? Coolant reservoir is empty. So looking all along this line, following this line all the way over, and here's our culprit. As you guys can see, I must have leaned on this, snapped this coolant hose. You know, kind of sucks, but stuff happens, is what it is. We're gonna go ahead and fix that. It's definitely the worst when you figure out you got an issue. And there's those brief moments of you don't know what the issue is or how much it's going to cost. We are just like, oh, no. But luckily, for, luckily enough for us, this is the coolant hose. $30 piece. Should be a quick, simple fix. It's two clips on each side. We're going to release with a pick tool. And then it should be as simple as plugging it back in. Refilling the coolant reservoir with some coolant. Calling it a day. So the car currently... He's yelling at me, telling me that my coolant's low. So once we top that off, should be our fix. So using a small pick tool, we're gonna go ahead and lift this little, little tab and it just pops right up. So off the other hose, a better, better view for it. Just, I know it's a little dark, but bear with me fam. This little pick pop right up. And that same thing on the other side. So then here's a closer look. All you gotta do is get these little tabs lifted up and the plug should just slide right off. And then same with the other side. Just lift up these little wire tabs. Should slide right off. And then we're good to go. Alright, so camera just died on me, but we top the coolant reservoir off with some coolant. There's a little triangle like right in here. I don't know if you guys can see that. It lets you know where to top off at. Everything is fully installed. All the clips, one. Where we got one, two, three. I think it's four. So one clip, two clip, three clip, and then four. Everything's clicked back into place. A little metal piece just clips right back in good to go so hopefully this helps you guys out quick simple little fix no more coolant leaking all over your cement and your driveway and whatnot so i'll have the part number listed down below and also keys motorsports is having their black friday sale drop in a couple of days so i'll have links down below for that as well so make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it if it helped you out make sure to subscribe to your boy i'll see you guys in the next one peace Thank you.